The three aspects to life that I see, money, people, and God. That's for me. It may not be your three. It might be Sudoku, pool, <laughs> and wine. Just decide what they are. So money. Ooh, whoa, good catch. I'm not a good catch, though. So <laughs> She's already like, don't no destroy it. Crystal, it's yarn. <laughs> God. <laughs> People coming at you. Me? Oh! <laughs> You're lucky, girl. I can see where people are. Yeah. Yeah, Just torn up and tattered. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> so what we do is this. And this is the traditional thing. This is the traditional teaching about this. What we do is we say, all right, I need to block out my life and go, okay. Here's the people section of my life. I need to block out the time for that. Here's the God section in my life. I don't remember which color was which, but that's good enough. And here's the money. Let's make that money because it's blue. Here's the God section because that's esoteric. So we've got money, God, people. How many seminars have we been to that go, take your time, Block your time. Now let's put the people time in. Now let's put the God time in. You and I have been to the same seminars. Now let's put the money time in. And we're going to try and balance this. Doesn't work. Doesn't work. We've all been to the seminars. My uh, mother-in-law knows personally. Maxwell, New Covey, all of them ran executive training at the highest level for the executives who run the nuclear power industry. Flew them all over the country in helicopters. That was her job. Met them all, talked to them all, all of them. All their books out there, making a fortune. And I think little by little, people think a little bit and they grow a little bit. But the bottom line is, time blocking doesn't work. Time blocking can help in a business structure to a degree. I'm going to set mornings four times a week on cold calls and that kind of thing. I'm not going to go into that. It's very, very, very basic. I'm trying to be a little bit more advanced with you today. The most common question that people ask Annette and I is this. How do you fit it all in? Now, I will tell you something I absolutely freaking guarantee that we work more hours than anybody in this room. That's a fact. So I want you to understand, if your hours are compressed, then you're not going to achieve as much as us. It's possible if you land on some miraculous invention or whatever, you know, people get lucky. But in terms of a business process, I'm into business processes. I'm into life processes. Do you know why, Patrick, I'm into life processes? Because there's nothing special about me. And that was the hardest thing in the world for me to learn. I've had friends who've made a bazillion because they came up with some crazy invention or... You, you understand my point. There's actually nothing special about me. But what I did is I learned how to take an ordinary person and create something extraordinary through adversity. So I learned systems. So I'm into systems. That's why I teach systems all the time. It's who I am. There's nothing special about me. So how do we make it work? And if you like, I see it like this. You know I'm into antiques and tapestry. And tapestries are made out of multiple colors. And so is life. So is life. What color is this one? People. So who are the people know. that mean everything to me in my life? Does anybody know in this room? Annette and Jonathan. Mm -hmm. Well, maybe you're looking. Mm -hmm. They're right at the top of the list. By the way, I have no guilt if somebody isn't special that I should make them special. If they want to be special in my life, they need to come over and take a special song. And if they can't, I don't have time chasing. 
I've got children who decided they want to go a completely different direction in life. No problem with that at all. But I will not see you every Christmas and Thanksgiving because I spend that with the people who want special. No problem with that at all. I view family completely differently to everybody else. Now, this is our family thread. This is our people thread. And it runs through my life. If you know me, you know this is true. So this thread runs through my life, and it's there. I am ever present with it. I do not time block it. I am ever present with the fact that Annette and Jonathan live and breathe, and I love them to death. And I will love them to my death. And then a wealthy attorney will pick her up in the wake in the parking lot. <laughs> She'll find somebody else, and I'm okay with that too. But right now, I love her to death. And this thread, Alex, runs through my life. Right there. Now, at the same time, I'm very interested in money. Why am I interested in money, Jenny? Period. I cannot remember the last time I went to a store. The last thing I bought in a store was something for the office on Amazon. I don't shop. I don't go and buy stuff. Every two years I buy a fancy car. That's it. Other than that, I buy flips. Why do I buy flips? Because it makes more money. And why do I need money? To support it. <laughs> because that thread is permanently in my life. So we have another thread that runs consistently through our life. And here's the trick. Because if I go, it's money time, and I pitch my family, money time for me is Monday through Friday, 9 to 5, and it's 6 o'clock, and the phone rings, and it's a buyer, or it's a flip, I'm going to take that call. Why am I going to take that call? Because I'm supposed to time block. Because Maxwell tells me I should time block. Covey tells me I could time block. Because they grew up in a different age. They are now old as I am old. And that's why I love kids like you coming in the team. Because you bring me back. Every time I look at you kids, I remember when I'm 30 and I say, I'm going to be 30 again. I want to think like a 30-year-old. I want to breathe like a 30-year-old. I want to act like a 30-year-old. I want to make money like a 30-year-old. That's why I love seeing you kids on the team. So you do a huge thing for me. So if I say it's money time, that's okay. But what if the people I can make money with haven't got the same timing? So I presented this concept to my family 20 years ago. And to Jonathan, as soon as he could talk, that in our family we weave. And we might be working on people things. So next week, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, I'll be on the beach looking like a whale in a wetsuit with my son doing some surfing. Badly. <laughs> but let me tell you something. He knows that every two hours I will get up from that beach, I will walk into the beach house, I will check my computer, I will check what's happening to the team, I will check what opportunities there are. So you go, well, you don't understand time blocking. Oh, yeah, I do. Because they all understand what we're building. And so, just like a tapestry, every day, People and money weave together. This is why I never get drunk, by the way. <laughs> oh, no, I'm not joking. You know why? Because the minute I get drunk, my tapestry falls apart. Because I can't do this when I'm drunk. So I weave. I weave. You do this, by the way. I see you do it. You all work like an animal, like a football player. Show 19 people on the weekend. And you weave in a, something with your son. 
doing it tonight? All right. Weaving. I want, here's the idea. I'm not preaching to you guys. I'm trying to help you understand a viewpoint that all the training seminars I've been to, I've never seen anybody do this. They're all preaching time blocking. It will not work. Oh, yeah.